gentlemen, this country of ours is unique in one very important respect. We're the only nation in the world where practically every family has its own transportation system. Here in America, there's an automobile for every four and a half feet. And every car and truck you see on the road was put there by some salesman. The automobile business offered a great opportunity for salesmen in the past. And because car buyers have been so well satisfied with this method of individual transportation, the selling of automobiles offers a still greater opportunity to salesmen today. But the fact that practically every family already has an automobile puts the new car salesman into the trading business. A salesman's job today is to trade the prospect out of his old car or truck and put him in a new one. That's why every Ford salesman must be skilled in trading techniques. And now, gentlemen, we're going to break up this meeting with the usual closing thought. The Ford salesman's biggest investment is his time. Make the most of it. Okay, boys, let's bring in some deals. Herb, uh, Herb Porter, and uh, Joe, I'd like to talk to you two a minute. Herb, one of the best ways for a new man to get started in this business of selling cars and trucks is to spend a little time with someone who knows all the angles. Now, Joe Thorne here is a good man to show you the ins and outs of the business. Joe, I'd like to have you take Herb with you for a few days, see how you do things. Is that all right with the both of you? Sure. You bet it is, Mr. Fuller. OK, then, the best of luck to you, Herb. And did you have good luck, Herb? Well, Charlotte, that's something you can't just answer with a yes or a no. A lot of things happened, and... Tell me about them, Herb. Well, it's a long-winded story, but anyhow, we went for a ride in Joe's demonstrator. Uh, Mr. Thorne, Joe. It's Joe, Herb. OK, Joe. I was wondering, I, I understand you're at or near the top in sales every month. So that means you must do things a lot different, huh? 